Hey, it's more like the period like this. You start with the technique first, you don't know the technique, you start yeah. to learn uh, one, two, three, after you have feeling. And after you have you feel ah I know it. Then you can adjust. Yeah. You have you think yeah you know it. If you stop there, you think you know it, but you you lose the opportunity to see mistake. If you stay do longer, after you start recognizing, oh I don't know here, I have some mistake here. So this is the part like when you go one technique, do longer. If you know the technique, keep doing it. And after you can found some detail and I can see your guys go more deep in some technique, I can go and give more detail. Mm -hmm. No, if I go give like all the details exactly one position, maybe it's too much in the beginning. Okay? Yeah. So I give you this part, keep it doing, keep it doing until you see like mistakes and correct technique, okay? So let's do uh, the same thing here. Okay, you go for the same idea for the, the sweep here. But now, like I told you, you know, for that technique, it's good if you can trap him. Don't keep like too much tense, because if you keep too much tense, the guy don't want to come. You want to give me a little bit freedom to come. He feel like he can pass. Mm -hmm. no? If I stack already this, he's dangerous. He's no he's dangerous for come. So you come here, okay? For that next position, it's more like you are a little bit more scared or because the guy is too heavy or you don't like, you don't want the guy coming close to you. In that situation, you keep like really strapped. But when I say strapped, you need to be 100%. You need to be locked. You cannot be a little bit, okay? You need to be 100%, okay? And now you choose that one, you need to keep that one into the end, okay? See how I do, I, I strap the knee and now I go to the end. I keep the knee here and I start to roll all the way. No, sometimes I can be like in that situation, sometimes it's follow, it's depending. And that one is important like here, okay? I go here, it's stretch, keep it, and when I cross everything, I can let go that grip and I already cross that side then. Okay, I don't go between the leg now because I want to spin everything. And see how my hips are already a little bit lift, too easy to move. See, I touch here, and then I can change the catch. I have the grip and keep the knee that way, okay? Go all the way and now take it more to the top and the position. Or sometimes he's just flip, okay? Go here. That one, I catch. Now I need to keep 100% strap. I create all that gap. When I create down that gap, I go run. And then we have that, okay? Go one more time. So go easy, slow first because I want to see if your guy is able to keep the knee straight and able to spin it, okay? If you keep the, the hips in the ground here, it's hard to spin. Okay, so this one is important. Lift a little bit. Okay, lift and move. And see how my hips is not on the ground. Yeah. Because now from here I have the power of the hips down too. You know, I go here and go down. And like before, now you need this, this one needs to be fast, okay? And you can go direct just for one, two. For example, here I have the control. I put the foot there, and now I go. Give me that way. Okay? So change the partner that way.